What if the next soldier on the battlefield isn't human at all? We're no longer talking about science fiction. Right now, engineers around the world are building incredible military robots and combat machines designed to be stronger, faster, and more resilient than any person. These aren't just drones. They are true super soldiers in the making. If you find the line between man and machine fascinating, hit that subscribe button because you're about to see where that line is being erased. Our first stop is South Korea, where engineers from the human-centered artificial intelligence robotics laboratory have unveiled a titan of technology, the giant military robot, Big Man. This isn't just a machine. It's a powerful platform designed to perform tasks far beyond human capabilities. Imagine a real-life transformer, built not for the movies, but for the most dangerous places on Earth. Big Man is equipped with advanced actuators and a tactile control system, allowing it to manipulate objects with precision, even on unstable ground. Thanks to its adaptive motion control, it can move efficiently, lift crushing loads, and interact with its environment in real time. For a country that is technically still at war, this technology isn't a novelty, it's a strategic necessity. The primary applications for Big Man are battlefield engineering, casualty evacuation, demining, and disaster zone operations. South Korea is deadly, serious about creating superhuman combat machines, and Big Man is a terrifyingly real first step toward the super soldiers of the future. Meanwhile, Japan has been a powerhouse in advanced robotics for decades, and a recent presentation of their engineering advancements became a true sensation. According to Japanese media, the country's armed forces commissioned the creation of a military exoskeleton a system designed to dramatically enhance a soldier's physical power. After years of research, engineers unveiled the first working prototype, a giant robotic arm. The demonstration shocked journalists. The arm is incredibly fast and powerful, capable of lifting heavy objects and performing precise manipulations with the speed of a striking snake. Think of it as the arm of a giant anime mech brought to life. Experts note that a fully functional combat exoskeleton requires more than just mechanical strength. It needs advanced artificial intelligence and autonomous control. However, it's clear that Japan is closing in on a new generation of military technology that could redefine the soldier, CTA. If you had access to this robotic arm for a day, what would be the first thing you'd try to lift? Let us know your most creative answer in the comments below. At the Osaka Kanai Expo 2025, Kawasaki Heavy Industries also unveiled a futuristic vehicle that looks like it gallops straight out of a sci-fi epic. This is the four-legged hydrogen vehicle, Corio, a machine controlled by shifting its center of gravity. It moves like a mechanical mountain goat, confidently crossing rough terrain like mountains, forests, and rivers, making it perfect for tasks where conventional transport fails. Its hydrogen power source also points to a future of silent, long-endurance missions. Unsurprisingly, this platform is already being considered as a potential base for military operations, delivering equipment to inaccessible areas, evacuating the wounded, and conducting reconnaissance. Yet, Corio also holds immense promise in the civilian world for rescue missions, scientific expeditions, and even a new form of extreme tourism. It's a perfect example of how future technology can serve two very different masters. But not all Japanese robots are designed purely for combat. The Japanese company Kawasaki Heavy Industries is developing a versatile humanoid robot that walks the line between civilian and military use. Meet the eighth generation robot, the humanoid rescue robot, Kid Toledo. Currently, Kido is positioned as a rescue machine but the Japanese military is watching its development with keen interest. Standing 180 centimeters tall and weighing 86 kilograms, it can walk on various surfaces, lift heavy objects, and perform a wide range of tasks. Kawasaki has been working on Kido since 2015, and many experts believe that with today's mature technology, the era of the practical humanoid robot has finally arrived and now for something completely different. From robotic strength, we turn to superhuman resilience. 
the advanced materials company DuPont demonstrated the incredible fire-resistant properties of its protective suit. In a dramatic experiment, researchers show how ordinary fabrics react to fire. They ignite instantly and burn to ash. Then they expose the fire-resistant protective suit DuPont to intense open flames. The result is astonishing. The suit doesn't catch fire. It only becomes slightly charred on the surface, retaining its structure and protective properties. It's made from high-tech aramid fibers like Nomax and Kevlar, which have exceptional thermal resistance. These materials don't melt, drip, or sustain combustion, making them a literal lifesaver for firefighters, military personnel, and anyone working in high-risk environments. CTA What other extreme condition would you want a suit to protect you from? A deep-sea trench or the vacuum of space? Drop your choice below. The future of technology is unfolding faster than ever. These combat machines and advanced robotics are pushing the boundaries of what's possible, for better or for worse. The question is no longer if these machines will be part of our world, but how we will choose to use them. What did you think of these incredible inventions? Let us know in the comments which one blew your mind the most. If you enjoyed this glimpse into the future, show your support with a like for more deep dives into the technology that is shaping our tomorrow.